hey what's going on guys welcome back to this video and in today's video we are going to see how to schedule content visibility in DV. so let's say you want to run a sale event on your website and want to show a specific section of your page from a specific time let's say uh, 14th August from 14th August to 20th August and uh, this is where this extension is gonna help you so you also got so many other options such as business hours and uh, user roles so you can also show or hide content based on user role you can also go with business hours so you can select days and time to show content and lots of other options so let's see how this extension is gonna help you and let's get started so if you want to purchase a DV Supreme Pro plugin, go through the first link in the description of this video and that is an affiliate link which means if you will follow that link to buy the DV Supreme Pro, I'll get some small commission that really helped me to make more videos like this. And from here you will choose a plan, uh, this agency plan, I will recommend you to go with it because it's for a limited time only. So click on buy now and use my discount code. J10 and click on apply coupon to get a massive $19 off and you will pay $179 instead of $199. I hope that helps. So here I am in my WordPress dashboard and from here I will need to enable the extension from the settings page. So make sure that you have purchased the DV Supreme Pro plugin for all the features. This extension is also available in their free version. If you want all the features then you need to go with their pro versions. So I have installed the pro version here and I'll go to Deep Supreme and from here go to general settings and then enable scheduled element and then save changes and that's it so before you start make sure you go to settings and from here you need to set up your time zone and save the changes here on my this page I have a section that I want to show as a sale event so yeah here this section this this column uh, i want to show it from 14th august to a specific date so i will go to this row settings go to column settings advanced visibility and here i'll be able to use scheduled element so yeah just simply go and enable it so here we need to choose uh, even show or hide so i would like to show it from 14th August but uh, yeah let's go with 13 because it's the current date of when I'm recording this video and uh, currently the time is 11 19 and uh, let's go with 11 19 or maybe 11 20, 20 25 and then from 13th August 11 25 and uh, it will be shown till 13th August 11 let's say 11 30 a five minute sale it's just because of this demo i want to show you show it to you quickly and as we have made those changes you need to enable this use between date slash time and uh, yeah make sure that you have selected show from this drop down and then save changes so because currently the time is 11 20 and thus this section will show from 11 25 to 11 30 and let's go and exit this visual builder and as you can see the section is currently not visible because it will uh, it will show from 11 25 to 11 30 it will show only for five minutes and that's it so let's wait for 11 25 So it's 11.25 and yeah let's refresh this page. So as you can see after 11.25 this section is now appearing and the user who will see this, this section will take advantage of your sale. So uh, it's only available for 5 minutes and after 5 minutes it's gonna disappear. So yeah that's how this extension works and i really like it and it will solve problems of so many people so let's see if it disappears after 11 30. so as you can see it's now 11 30 and the section is still here but it's gonna go away when i will refresh this page so let's go and refresh this page so as you can see this section is no more and uh, 
that's how it's gonna help you so you don't have to go to their section or module visibility and change the visibility every time so this this is how this extension is super duper useful and uh, and let's see some of the other features like a uh, user role and business hours all right so let's see how to hide content based on user role so i have a section right over here that i want to show to log out the users and logged in users will not be able to see this section so let's go to this row setting and then this column settings advanced visibility and from here use scheduled element and make sure that uh, you have selected show and then scroll down to this apply to this text right over here and visitor users so this section will now be shown to the visitor users who they are not logged in so let's save it so i have opened that url in this incognito mode and from here i will see this section as you can see it is currently appearing because i'm currently logged out so let's see here here i am logged in and exit this visual builder because on this window i'm logged into my wordpress website and i'll not see this section as you can see it's not here because i'm logged in it's only available to logged out users right over here so i'm currently logged out logged out here and uh, i'm able to see it so when i'll be logged in i will not see this column so that's how this user role thing works in dv supreme's scheduled element extension so the last thing we need to see is business hours so finally let's see how to use business hours to hide content so here i have this module with this phone number so let's say i want to show it from monday to friday and from a specific time to a specific time and i'm saying this specific a lot in this video sorry for that but yeah i have to say it so let's go to this scheduled element extension and enable it and from here so make sure that you have selected show from here and then enable use business hours slash time so this this module will be shown from monday to friday from 8 am to 8 pm or i don't know what is 18 in 12 hours format but let's say here uh, 18 okay it's correct so this this module will be shown will be shown from monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday from 8 pm to 18 8 am to 18 i don't know <laughs> and uh, this module will not be uh, shown on saturday and sunday because that is weekend so uh, let's save it because it's thursday so i would like to select thursday from here and then save it and now uh, on this front end as you can see that this uh, this phone number area is still here but when i will refresh this page it's not here anymore so that's how this use business uh, this business hour slash time works and i really really like this extension by dv supreme and it solves a lot of problems of mine and it will also solve a lot of problems of yours because uh, when you need to run a sale event and want to show something or i uh, notice then this is where this extension is gonna help you so let me know what you think about this beautiful extension for the dv in the comment section below and make sure to like this video and don't forget to subscribe because i need more subscribers and uh, press the bell icon and that's it have a great day peace out